Alright, we're going to be heading back into the StarCraft 2 Wings of Liberty campaign today. I will also be uploading one more video today, but it's just to make up for, well, again, it's to make up, but still. So today, we're going, we had just, yesterday we finished Liberation Day, and as we can read here, the Dominion's hold on Marsara has indeed been now crippled. And apparently Tigus is back, offering a contract for needed funds for the resistance movement. Hmm. Alright. Well then. Let me guess, it's about to show... It's about to show another cutscene, isn't it? Or the same one? We'll see. Yep, alright. So yeah, we can just go on to like a previously with this. like old times already. Old times. Anyway. So yes, that was just the cutscene again, in case you wanted to see it again. And there will be one, there is going to be one cutscene that I will definitely skip again. That I will definitely, that I will probably skip. Hopefully it's a one-timer though. This is Donnie Vermillion, live from the UNN studios on Core Hall. We've got a breaking story for you. But I'm not Let's broken. Live to our own Kate Lockwell on the fringe world of Marsala. Kate? Thanks, Donnie. Rebel Jim Rayner has reappeared in a big way. He's attacked a Dominion Depot near Backwater Station, seizing weapons and distributing them to the local populace. Kate, I bet the locals are pretty nervous about having a notorious outlaw in their No. Day. Actually, Donnie, the people I talked to seem really encouraged by it. You heard it here first. Jim terrorizing the locals on my side. What? I'm talking, pal. I'm just getting started. Alright. Hmm, Viking. I know what this is. This looks recent. Is your blue, Jimmy? 
Folks in these parts are ready to fight back against Max. Guess they just needed a little push. You still take this whole revolution thing pretty serious, then. Everyone needs a hobby, Tychus. Also, there's one thing I was questioning last time. Last time it is saying they're shooting civilians move in, but then all the but then the civilians were shot while they were aiding. It's it's probably nothing though. Call me curious, but you get out. That's just a silly idea. I busted out of my cryo freezer while they were transporting me to New Folsom. Oh. I must have killed at least a dozen guards with my bare hands. <laughs> yeah, I've heard this one before. But you left out the part where you walked on water. Made off with the warden's daughter. Um, Don't you get up buddy with me, boy. Yeah. I heard all about you becoming a big-time freedom fighter while I was away. What happened, Jimmy? The war for truth and justice get too much for you. I ain't licked yet, Tychus. And I promise you, Minx is going down, one way or another. Anyway, that was all the dialogue. Let's get started. Thanks to your actions, Marsara is now in a state of open revolt against Arturus Minx. Ex-convict Tychus Findlay has revealed the Dominion came to Marsara to excavate an alien artifact. Seizing the artifact will strike another blow against the Dominion and generate funds from selling it to Finlay's mysterious contacts. Oh no, that no, we gotta do that. We get paid and we strike a blow. This no, that's good. Don't like anything special? Keep your shit on, sir. Dominion engineers been digging out here for months. See that crane? They're getting ready to move the artifact they found off world. Well, I'll be damned. See, you gotta have a little more faith, Jimmy. All right, time to give the Dominion a wake-up call. Let's smash that base and haul that baby out of there. Perfect. And okay, the outlaws. Now that is already a very big key hinter there. All right. This one's an easy start. Just get yourself mining and get to it, and just get started. All right, there are two Hellions over there. Commander, additional tutorials are available for you. To All right, continue. that Dominion base is a little decked out. We'll need a lot more Marines before we take on the Dominion outpost. Train them up at the barracks. While we're at it. Extra SCVs will help us harvest minerals faster. Train them up at the command center. Go ahead. Well, perfect. Ah, you me. This first one is definitely just an introduction mission. This one's not too hard. Uh -huh. Things only really get dicey when it gets to the third mission. Third mission, we have some interesting. We have some interesting things come in. Additional supply depots required. Yeah, I know. I need additional supply. Don't need to remind me, game. And if I remember correctly, there should be a mineral pallet over there. Oh, well, there isn't. I know I need to make some quick resources, so I might send a quick search party out soon. Because I know you're not going to stop bugging me. There you go. Not enough minerals. I want to I want to get a lot more on minerals first.
Because most of what's going to be this army is costing in minerals. Yes, that is very confusing what I just said, but it is kind of correct. Most if not everything that is going to be used here costs minerals. Not enough minerals. I have not found a single item that requires Vespine. And only Vespine. Alright. I'll send out that I'll send out that scout like I was saying I was gonna do. There we go. Additional supply depots. Let's find out where. That's fine. Sure. Okay. I know there are some resource pallets up there. I'm kind of just waiting for. Oh, more supply. All right. I'm waiting for the trigger to happen when. When it gets to a rebel group that's about to be attacked, I think. Tell them I didn't mean to spoil some of the mission, but if not actually all the mission, but still. Yep, and there we go. Alright, I'll get to I'll get to the attack. There's no way we're leaving them to rot. And I think that base continues to be attacked even after you have defeated the even after you rescued them. Armed and ready. We could use some help here. Marine, pull back. Go ahead, go up there, you need to be healed. You got it. And there we go. That's fine. Where you want us. Welcome aboard, boys. Dominion can go to hell. Oh, really? It's Rainer's boys. Rainer's the man. Roger that. SCV ready. Let's make we two more medics before here. moving out. Oh. <laughs> yeah, like I said, they continue to attack. So that's one thing to watch out for. Was there any other resource balance? I think there are only 11 on the map. Yeah, there was only 11. We're good. The doctor is in. This should be a plentiful amount in order to take out that Dominion base. Bad guys are that away. Yeah, I see him. Warning. Dominion Hellions approaching. We're not gonna do much. There we go. Just give a moment for everyone to get healed up. And I think they actually would be a problem later when you actually have to deal with like four of them. And that's when it really becomes a problem. Nice job. But before then, not really. I forgot which mode they face four of them in, but they're very hard to kill. Especially with only these. Oh my! Or something else, I don't know actually right now. I'll just finish off this base and call it a day.
Again, these ones won't be too long. Because it's just gonna be over one mission. Tomorrow's might be a little longer. Considering it'll be a that. Considering it'll be a mission that's 20 minutes long anyway. As well as all the dialogue. And the cutscenes, so yeah. It'll be a little longer. Maybe up to 30 minutes at most. There you go, there's all the supply. Let's just... Let's just remove these workers from the equation. And there we go. We've won. There's no way to say it out otherwise. But sure, I'll train some more SCVs, get a few more Marines. And we'll just see what... And... We'll just see what happens. Now... I'm not going to reveal anything else. Other than the fact that I can click on the enemies and figure out how much HP they have. Which was how I figured out that on casual enemies HPs are reduced by half on the Terran campaign. Crane control established. Beautiful. Now let's reel that sucker in and get out of here. Well, that's a cool looking artifact. Ah, there are on ah, there was only nine to have, alright. Only lost three units, alright. Oh, there's nothing oh, there's no cutscene. Well then. I'll leave it here and uh, we'll see, we'll see you all actually in a little bit.